Good morning guys. I'm here at Kmart in Hagerstown. The store is closing and everything is like 75% off. Um, and for some reason that it's really fun to walk around the store and be like, what are you going to find? And, and how much on sale is it? Um, I'm here to get some baby clothes for Jesse because they're so cheap. Um, and it's really cold outside. So I thought today would be a good day to do some inside work with Punky, the boxer who's with me because she has barely any hair and she gets really cold even with a jacket on outside. I have her in a downstay in the back seat of the car. Um, we just got here. She did great holding her downstay and now we're going to be practicing her healing, sitting, downstays, maybe some recall and just overall calm and polite behavior inside the store. Let's see how she does. air ventilation system right here is making a really loud noise and as we walked by Punky was very nervous about it um, and her first reaction was just to, to flee They go into fight or flight. She started freaking out and wanted to just run away from it. So what do I do? I put her in a downstay right here and let her experience for herself that this thing is not hurting her. And so over time, she becomes desensitized to these noises and sounds and things that scare her. But if we never expose her to it, she will always think that fleeing is the right thing to do. And that's what's quote unquote saving her. Okay, so hear how loud that thing is? We're going to park ourselves right here and let her experience it. Good girl. Sit. Down. Good girl. Down. Shopping for shoes. With a very well behaved boxer puppy. Down. Punky's doing so great. Uh, I just wanted to talk about how the more trips like this she takes outside the home in a controlled way where we're showing her the big scary world and also showing her that nothing happens to her when a sound turns on, somebody walks by, it's no reason to get frantic and excited and want to flee, the better she'll be. And she'll become completely desensitized to all these types of things and field trips and outings will be no big deal. We're walking around Kmart in Hagerstown, and as you can see, it's closing, but it provides a really, really, really cool spot for me to train and walk punky indoors today because it's so cold outside. She hardly has any fur. Um, her little lips are already chapped from our walk yesterday and the day before, so here we are healing inside the store, and it's actually so perfect because we've got people pushing stuff all around everywhere there's noises there's stuff like slamming on the ground randomly and it's so good for her she needs to be desensitized to these noises um, and so what we're doing is holding her accountable for her heel command so even if you're scared it doesn't mean you can jump and lunge the other way um, 
we put her in a down command as carts go by um, next to something scary and she learns, hey, this world isn't so bad. These things actually aren't hurting me. And I know my owner and I trust my owner and I trust that that person is not gonna let anything happen to me. So what we get is a dog who's just calm, relaxed, uh, has faith in the owner, and is easy to take places. Good girl. The double down is the most relaxed form of the down stay. She puts her chin on the ground and totally relaxes. Good girl. Out of sight, down stay. Very, very, very good for her confidence in the command. When she moves her hips over like that, it's a little bit more relaxed. Down. I help her out by having her put her chin down again. Good girl. And this is a dog that you really can take anywhere. You can, because she's so calm, she's so relaxed. You can take her to stores, restaurants, downtown Frederick. She's not always concerned about what's going on around her. Good girl. Come. Good girl. See if I can go into a heel. Heel. Good girl. Practicing our off-leash heel. All around Kmart. Good girl. Down. Nice work, punk. Six months old. Come. Good girl. Good girl. Sit. Good. Heel. Yeah, girl. Does anyone else like reading greeting cards? And like Valentine's Day cards and birthday cards? That's what I'm doing right now. And I've got a very good punky accompanying me in a very calm down stay. down.